Hey guys, I am here to film my Q&A video. Um, I don't have a lot of questions, but there are a few questions that y'all ask on Twitter. So, I have all of my notes on my phone. So, um, the one question that I got asked twice was what made me want to start a YouTube channel. And I started a YouTube channel in February 2016. I don't know the exact date, but what made me want to start it was we were going through a rough patch at the time and not with money or nothing like that, but with social media. Um, I recorded a bunch of videos that I put on Facebook and somebody hacked my Facebook and deleted everything I had of Christian when he was a baby. Like I had so many videos and I'm still crushed about that because I will never get that back. Like ever. I was totally crushed. Like I cried about it because it tore me up. Like they took everything off my Facebook. I couldn't even log in my Facebook no more. They just took it off like the Facebook didn't even exist no more so I started recording again and then you know I had I do have one passion I do have a passion for makeup and I was thinking about doing some makeup videos and then I was like you know what maybe I should start a YouTube channel I was watching Brittany and baby at the time and how she does everything and you know, she, I watched her for years. She inspired me to do YouTube. Like, I watched her from the beginning all the way to the end. And as she learned how to do YouTube, I thought they were just part of something. I didn't know that they started from the bottom and now they're there. <laughs> so, I just posted. I was very nervous. I'm a very shy girl. Um... I do like to talk a lot, you know, but I always had that passion for makeup and, you know, day in the lives and the stuff that I would watch, I wanted to put out there. As I still watched her videos, um, I noticed the channel KK and Baby J. I absolutely love them, how their editing skills are. I watched OK Baby and how they started and, you know, I just... To me, I can put as many videos as I want on YouTube and still have them there. You know, they're not going to go nowhere. And to me, you know, I did not want to put anything on Facebook no more because after that incident. And so now I get to go back on my videos and I get to watch them. Yes, I do watch my videos. And sometimes I do cry because my boys are getting so big. And it's just, it's crazy. It's crazy. It's crazy. But what really, really got me started was after I had kids, I always have something to go back on. And it's an amazing feeling. Um, of course, you know, my first YouTube video, um, to me, it sucked. I don't want to take none of that down. I'm never going to take none of that down because that's, it shows my achievements on everything. So, yeah. That's why I wanted to start YouTube was so I can always go back on my videos and how my pregnancy videos, if I'm ever going to miss that belly and no, I'm never going to miss that belly because I still go back on that and I'm like, oh, I look so cute. And then I go, I go look at my videos and I'm like, mm, no girl, you was not cute. You were huge. And I talked about my feelings and stuff. So. If I ever want to have another baby, I'm really going to have to be desperate to have another baby. Somebody asked me, how do I stay motivated to film and post? Um, to me, YouTube is not a job. It's something I can always go back on. I've, I think I said this before. If I'm not in the mood to film, I'm not going to film. I like to put positive videos out there. Like, of course, my few videos was nervous. You know, I was nervous. I was like... I don't know what people going to think about me, but, you know, <laughs> as I got more into it, I just think YouTube is very fun. It's exciting and, you know, I stay motivated because it's something that helps me with my anxiety, um, especially the editing part. You know, I do have really bad anxiety. 
you know that's never it's probably never going to change yes i'm on medication for it but you know things that i do to keep my mind off of it it helps so much and youtube has really been a big part of that like with i don't think i could go without youtube anymore because after i found out it really did help me i wanted to continue and edit and learn new things and all of this and you guys y'all inspire me with y'all's videos and i learn through y'all and that's how i stay motivated is i keep posting i still stay excited about it i try to put things like i want to film every day like i'm thinking about doing daily vlogging and i'm also thinking about doing a whole makeup playlist on here only because yes i said i have a passion for makeup i want to do it so i'm gonna do it like you guys will see i'm gonna do it and cooking i also have a passion for cooking so i'm gonna do that so i want to put like a lot like i want to be working a lot because it just helps me so much with my anxiety so i'm gonna do i'm trying to do daily vlogging i know i've been posting videos every day or two videos a day so i want to keep it going like i enjoy it you don't enjoy you know vlogging or um, posting videos you're not going to be motivated at all it's something you're going to have to have a passion for and YouTube is my passion and I love it love it so much somebody asked do I go to church I did go to church and I enjoyed going to church and I am a Christian right now we are not going to church only because everything is so hectic with two kids and I just can't get up early enough and it's just crazy you know I, I do want to go back to church yes I will be going back to church yes so favorite book I know this is probably old but it's the only book that I can remember that I enjoyed was the boxcar children um <laughs> it just sounds so childish but i really enjoyed that book it was my favorite book of all times all times favorite quote is i can do all things through christ and that will always be my favorite i have it on a cross that someone made um in bentley's room and i absolutely love that quote because it's so true favorite movie is bad moms and they're coming out with another movie for christmas and i'm so excited i cannot wait i've watched the movie like three or four hundred times not really but three or four times and i'm really thinking about after this video i'm gonna go watch it because i just got so excited i love it love it love, love it favorite food it's gonna sound really boring but ramen and um white rice but like with teriyaki sauce yeah yeah it sounds boring but um it's good it's really good and, and that is all the questions you guys had for me so i hope you guys enjoyed this video and i hope that this video answered all y'all's questions and i will be doing another q a like, I want to do another Q&A in another month. Like, every month I want to try to do another Q&A. So, think of questions and or comment down below or put it on Twitter. Um, my Twitter my Twitter name is at the end of this video. So, go follow me on Twitter. Ask me some questions and I will do another Q&A in another month. So, I will see you guys in my next video. Make sure to give this video a thumbs up and hit subscribe. I guess. Hey, no, 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 no.